Hi there, and thank you for for being here. Thank you for popping in if you've been here before. Hey, welcome back. It's great to see you. And if you're new, welcome in. My name's Tree, and the purpose of my videos is to just provide you with some gentle relaxation, some chit chat, some some ways of just getting away from it and just to hang out with maybe with someone who you consider a friend in a way. Uh, I do stream on Twitch and if you would like to, to see me when I'm live I do that on Friday nights, Saturdays and Sundays and as I've mentioned before if you have seen me on YouTube and you pop into my Twitch, do say hi and tell me that you saw me on YouTube and I will give you your own poop just for you. Okay. Today I thought I would I would play catch up. I have not played this particular game and I've seen some streamers play it but you'd, you'd think it would be a, a treacle game and you'd think that I'd have played it lots in the past but I have not and that game is Unpacking Unpacking Now, some of Unpacking there's like an underlying there's a sad story to it and that, that can trigger Oh, the sad stories do trigger me. I am, I'm a softy. I can't help it. I'm a very empathetic person and I've been through some things and sometimes, sometimes events will remind me of those things. So I don't think I'm going to delve too deeply into unpacking. So if you want to play it yourself, you can do. But I thought I, I would just dive in and take a little look at it. And I would say see what all the fuss is about, but I don't mean that in a kind of cynical way. I, I'm i interested in giving this game a go myself. I love buildy games, and this isn't exactly a buildy game, but um, let's see what I make of it, shall we? Come with me. Come on. Now, as I always say in these videos, I have turned the music off just in case I want to edit it later. Um, I don't want to kind of like mishmash the music and have these harsh cuts. So uh, I will be adding my own gentle music. And do let me know by the way if it's too loud or too quiet. It's a journey and I'm trying to get there. So this does not have the music, so that's not to say that the music for the game is not good. It is just from an editing perspective, I prefer to not use game music. Because I don't want any harsh cuts, okay? So this is unpacking. Unpacking. Okay. This is my very first time. I had definitely been around for a while in 1997. So let's unpack these boxes. This looks like it could be maybe a child's room. It's a single bed. I loved this style of bed. I never had one as a child. This was not the sort of bed I had myself, but I definitely, definitely wanted it. Um, Maybe we put, put the ball on the floor for now. And, oh that's cute. Oh, we could probably open these, right? Okay. Let's just take some things out and put them down and then we can, we can take it from there. So, is that, if that's pens and pencils, we'll maybe put it there. 
Now I kind of expect... I kind of expect things to look pretty similar from streamer to streamer, but I don't know. I don't know. I do wonder whether maybe some of the scenes Things can only go in certain places. Okay, so there's there's a lot of these books. Oh, cute. Obviously, I am an excellent artist. What else do we have? Lots of books. Oh, I never had one of these as a child. Oh, is that a dreidel? Oh, it's like operation, but it's called procedure. <laughs> Um, I wonder if I can open this side. There we go. I wonder if I can open this drawer. Oh, I can. I can put little things in the drawer. Oh my goodness, how cute. Yes, please. I should probably use the bookshelf for the books, right? I'm sure this is quite photograph worthy. I'm so glad that that it did not have my real name there. I could have doxed myself. Take it back. There, there probably are a few different ways of unpacking these things. Certainly for this room, anyway. No, little froggy. A cutie. Pop them there. Oh. Can this move back a little bit? Yeah, yeah it can. It's a little cluttered. Hmm. Oh my gosh, lots and lots of stuff. Another pony. Oh, I used to have one of these. A Tamagotchi. Oh my goodness. I remember those. This is definitely... Yeah, this all rings a bell. As I said, I was around in... Did they say this was 1997? Wow. Oh my goodness. Let's see what else there is. Mm. 
Let's take that one there. There we go. More books. Why does that... That, um... Book cover somehow looks familiar and I don't know why. Okay, so... Let's move some stuff around. Also... What? Is it telling me that some stuff is wrong? I would not have thought that there could be a wrong in this game, you know? Or are these key items? Hmm. So now that's not... I'm supposed to put these on the bed. Like I say supposed to, I don't want to think that there is a supposed to. And ideally there shouldn't be a right and a wrong way to do this. I'm thinking I could put the bag down here. Why? I don't understand why it's Red. What's this? Okay, that's... So this has stopped blinking now. And this... Has not. Maybe it was supposed to have gone in the drawer. But again, I don't like the idea that it was supposed to have done anything. I thought the idea was. accidentally did a thing. Okay, what have we got? 2004. I would say I remember it well. I do not. I do not remember 2004 well. Um, I, I don't know what that is. Um, so we've got some shelves, so I guess we could put the books on the shelves and still continuing their art which is nice but they keep pursuing those passions okay so this one I'm guessing is gonna go here No, I recognise this little chap. Oh, that's gonna go in the bathroom, I guess. Oh, there's a box in here. Um. Oh, I could pop it up here. Put the same over here. We don't think we need. Unless the mug is one that has the toothbrush in it. There we go. Hmm. Maybe we pop this one here. We can put the first aid kit there. That's my bra. 
I think my bra needs to go in the pantry. Okay. And I almost, almost thought that was toothpaste, but I'm pretty sure it's more art stuff. Okay, where could we? I'm gonna try that there for now. Oh no, we've got some um, shelves over here, right? Do my keys work? No. Okay. I think that works now. I honestly wish that everything was as folded and neat as this. Can we do something with this? There we go. Need to, to sort stuff out. I've got itchy nose. I have no idea why my nose is suddenly itchy. Don't feel like a pair. Like okay. I mean. Okay. Oh, more shoes. Oh, of course. Peels you. Oh, Doc Martens though. Wait, wait. Where's the other one? Maybe we'll come across that later. Oh my goodness, yes. The towers. They were quite big back in the day. I was saying on stream that um, one of the, well, the, the PC that we had when I was a child was an Amstrad PCW9512 with electronic daisy wheel printer. Oh yes, we were talking on stream recently about about games that we played when we were younger and I was trying to remember which game it was that I was thinking of, that I had in mind and I remember that you were a princess and you fell into a pond and at one point, although you were a princess, you were a troll princess and, um, and then I remembered there being was there was like a Alice in Wonderland type part of it and there were lots of puzzles and essentially we worked out, my chat worked out, that the game I was thinking of, which I played on my Amstrad PCW9512 with electronic daisy wheel printer, it was King's Quest 7 and I am very very excited because I have now, for old time's sake, I have picked up King's Quest 7. Hang on, are these posters? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, that's what I should have done in the last room. I'm an idiot. Right. But we knew that. Well, hopefully, because everybody else is going to be sensible and not as much of an idiot as me maybe maybe I actually did an entirely unique formation because I didn't realise you had to unroll the posters <sighs> see the thing is I don't I don't mind looking silly I am what I am, and it's also, I'm kind of, I'm human, <laughs> kind of human, I'm kind of human. I'm not going to turn these all around the right way, oh no that does not go there, I didn't realise we had a kitchen as well. Okay, so, I do think the toaster will probably need to go near the, oh there's even more boxes, okay. So maybe cups here. All sorts of different mugs. Very higgledy piggledy. I like that. Actually, um, I introduced some of my chat 
to the phrase higgledy piggledy. They hadn't, uh, hadn't experienced it before. I'm kind of putting the bowls here because I feel like bowls next to breakfast, you know, I feel like you should wake up and have a cup of tea, have a coffee, maybe some cereal. That, that is not a kitchen item treat. So I'm going to pop this here. And I'm going to have a section somewhere, I guess, for art stuff. So do I do that here? I feel like that's going to take up an awful lot of space. We'll try. We'll try for now. Pop that there. Can I put them up there? No. No, I cannot. It's fine. Okay. Now I should be able to pop the keyboard here. Okay. Some more pens and things. I can probably put those on there. And what's that? Is that another book? I relieved it to do the right way. Where else can we put? Hmm. <laughs> oh, do you know? I think that probably needs to go there. I can hang it. I can, I can hang it up. I think we got some plates up here. And my bowls here. And I guess we could stick some glasses on here. Mm -hmm. Oh, do you know what? We've got drawers as well. to just be a, almost strictly a um, tea person. In my old age, I've, I've started dabbling in coffee too. I'm quite partial to the odd coffee. I think it might be part of my Dutch roots. Um, my uncle or uncle, I think, maybe. I um, always used to have, and I picked this up from him, had uh, black coffee with um, and I think I so I wanted to be like him so I would uh, drink my coffee black too and I would have one sugar in it because I I've got kind of a sweet taste although that said um, 
if can I put can I put that like there? Will this now? Hang? Yeah, now that will hang. <sighs> Interesting. I think I would find it hard to choose between if you had to give up chocolate or cheese. I know some people would find it really easy. I would find that kind of kind of hard, I think. Oh wow, that's annoying. And I would probably be more inclined to give up chocolate than the cheese. What's this? Is this a sandwich press? Like, is that a panini press or a sandwich maker? Well, we're not going to use that very often, so I think that's the sort of thing that I would just, like, pop away somewhere. This does make me want to declutter a lot. Oh my word, I would definitely have that out of the way. It's not the sort of thing I would use a lot. What's that? I don't know. Oh, that's, um, cling film. I guess... Is do you guys, well you guys, do some of you call it sarin? Sarin wrap? Is that what you guys call cling film? I say you guys because, um... Uh, when I stream on Twitch, a lot of, uh, a lot of my viewers are from, um, America and Canada. This is not perfect. I would say this is very, very far from perfect. You, why would you put your salt up there, Katrina? Why, why would it be out of reach? Absolute muppet. Okay, so let's head back into here. And just start piling some more stuff. I think we're done. Okay. Okay. So, this could be the last room we have left. But there is quite a bit to go. I'm gonna pick up the pace slightly. What have we got here? Oh, more smalls. So many smalls. To be fair, I have more. I remember this. Ah. One of the things that uh, concerns me. Um, I mean, not in a I'm losing sleep over it at the moment way, but um, if I ever move, just the whole idea of packing everything up, my goodness, just, oh. I think I would, I think I've seen that there are companies that, you. I mean, you, you pay for it, but uh, you can pay companies to just come in and... What's this? I think... Hmm. That's headphones, isn't it? Oh... Okay, I got it. Um, yeah, you can pay companies to just pack everything up, which I think is... Uh, it's pretty useful for people who have like massive anxiety and are really stressed about that sort of stuff. And I recognise that little piggy. Oh, this is cute. I recognize some of these guys. And the ball. We had the ball before. I think it just gave me a little squeak as I placed it. That's adorable. One more box to go. And I had entirely missed that existing. Let's hang that up. I'm going to fold the t-shirts. Hang the other stuff, I think.
Oh, that's a fancy one. Some more smalls. Oh, that's not smalls, you silly tree. It's a little bus. <laughs> oh, now we've been to the Eiffel Tower. Don't think we had that before. Oh, this is our um. We just want to move it just here a little bit so they match. Our gym jams. And this is smalls. And uh, that would be another toilet roll. I mean, didn't uh, didn't find anywhere to pop that um, that towel. Uh, oops. Maybe I'll put the towel in here if I've got space. All my t-shirts, lots of jeans. Okay. Now it's telling me that things are wrong. up there. What's wrong with all of these? Am I just supposed to mash everything? I mean, I do have a lot more space now. And what else was flashing red? You were flashing red. I just wish I understood why. Why is this book red? Where does it want me to place it? Oh, it seems like there's some red stuff in the kitchen as well, because that's flashing at me too. Do we think that is toothpaste? Is that toothpaste? Actually, is it toothpaste after all that? No. Um... Well, I think it stopped flashing red at me. Is there anything else that's red in here? Such a chilled game. The uh, aggressive flashing red is... Uh... Oh. Oh my. If I just stick you up there. Do you want me to hang you up? Would that... No? Do you want me to throw you away? did a thing, but I feel like I was forced. I have to cook for myself. Uh-oh. Okay, well. There are plenty more rooms to unpack, but I just wanted to give like a gentle initial look at the game. Although, let's face it, most of you have probably seen it and played it and tried all sorts of combinations and unlocked all sorts of things. It was, um, yeah, that was genuinely, as you could see, that was my first, first try at it. And I, I do, I do think it's, it can be a bit emotional. It's a bit of a journey and I love that. It's, it's a beautiful game. Don't like getting shouted at by the red outlines. I feel that's a little bit aggressive, you know? <laughs> I'm not psychic, I don't know where everything goes, but I wanted to thank you 
for spending some time with me and um, hopefully you haven't been too judgmental about the errors that I have made. I wear my heart on my sleeve. I'm not going to edit out any mistakes because I'm an idiot. I'm going to share those with you so you can see that I am a silly billy. Thank you so much for choosing to spend some time with this old lady. As I said earlier, if you want to swing by and uh, watch me on Twitch, you can do so. You can do that on Friday nights and Saturdays and Sundays. And if you say that uh, you found me on YouTube, I will give you your own personal boop. Alright? Um, have a wonderful day, have a wonderful week or weekend. Or just try, try to get through. You've got this. Alright? And if you would like to subscribe or like those things mean the world to tiny content creators like myself so thank you if you do choose to do either of those things you take care